Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's me again, new week, new video. And this week I have another tutorial. Last week was a makeup tutorial. And today I have another tutorial, but it's a hair tutorial. And that's just because I asked you on Instagram which videos you guys wanted to see this week. And the majority of the replies were a hairstyle tutorial for short hair now that I cut all my hair off and you guys seem to be very curious about how I can do my hairstyles with this new hair because I used to do a lot of hairstyles when I had long hair so I feel like maybe you guys are a little bit worried and I'm gonna show you how it's possible to do really beautiful hairstyles with this short hair I usually don't do many tutorials in a row on this channel I like to just put some personality and fashion in between um, but yeah you guys seem to really want this content right now so I'm gonna give it to you but don't worry if you're one of the subscribers that prefers the personality fashion content don't worry it's coming next week I'm gonna bring it to you don't worry about it but in between just go subscribe I'm gonna wait go subscribe waiting have you done it Yes, done it? Perfect, welcome to this beautiful YouTube fam of ours and a lot of content is coming your way because I asked you on Instagram and you guys gave me so much good ideas so yeah, it's coming but right now I'm gonna show you some beautiful hairstyles for short hair let's roll the intro Okay, so now hairstyles the first one is the one and only super easy hairstyle, the most easy hairstyle in the world, which is the ponytail and it's what I like to call the messy ponytail that's just because now with short hair, if I just put my hair on a ponytail straight up the ponytail is the tiniest thing you ever saw but I just feel it's not as interesting because you cannot like put the ponytail here on the front um, so I feel it's very like blunt <laughs> yeah it's very like nothing special so I like to call it the messy ponytail because I like to bring some hairs to the front here maybe it was too much over there yeah maybe this was too much and some here if you don't have bangs you can grab more um, but I already have all this hair on front so just grabbing some hairs over here yeah like that and then you tie everything on the back with a hair tie where's my hair tie oh I forgot you need a hair tie for this and now you're going to tie all the hair here on the back and now I only need to twist my hair tie once like I do it like two rounds and that's it it's just so easy I never made like a ponytail this easy it was always like a pain to do my ponytail it was so heavy and now it's just so easy and I like it so much so yeah here's the messy ponytail okay now for our second hairstyle I'm going to do something very similar to a hairstyle that I did on my last hairstyle video where I had long hair which is um, the samurai hairstyle, samurai bun that, that time I think I did a bun this time it's not enough to do a bun I believe so I'm gonna do like the samurai a ponytail or the half updo kind of the vibes from how is that called? Hyunjun? Hyunjun <laughs> his name i'm sorry from stray kids you know the k-pop group he was kind of my info for this hairstyle and once again you need a hair tie and what we are going to do is just to grab half of the hair so we are going to leave some chunks here like i want to say half maybe like two thirds that we are going to grab I don't really like to be too slick with my hairstyles and go with my hairbrush here to smooth it out I like them to be a little like natural and messy and now that you have here all this hair we are going to tie it like we are doing a ponytail and I'm also going to grab hairs here on the front I think it really helps to look better 
This is basically uh, the hairstyle. It's just as easy as this. I do this a lot at home, just like the ponytail, because it takes like the big chunks of hair from my face. But I wanted to spice things up right now and go more towards the vibe of the Hyunjun. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so bad with Korean names. I'm going to grab this hair tie over here. Hairband, hair tie, hairband. Sorry, I'm bad at English too. <laughs> I'm like main language, so yeah, it's getting worse and worse. Um, I'm going to grab this hairband over here, which is great, kind of matches my outfit. And we are going to stray kids' vibes and apply this. Over here. I'm gonna do it like this and take it off the hand. So now the situation needs fixing, so we're just going to pull our half of the out of the hairband like this. And now I'm going to also just pull some hairs. But yeah, I really like this hairstyle. It's very different, very manly, but at the same time, um, kind of feminine as well. And I, I just love it. Kind of sporty, kind of streetwear. I might just wear it with this outfit. I think it's very pretty. And let's call this the Hyunjun Half Updo. Maybe something like that. This is it. Okay, now for our third one, we are going to do two half up, but half up pigtails. And this one I think is very pretty. Also, the inspo for this one was actually Kylie Jenner. And she wore these hairstyles, like the two half pigtails, and I thought it was so pretty. So my hair is already split in half. If you use your hair like this, with the side split, you will need to split the hair in half for this one and now like on top of the ear you're going to draw like a straight line with your finger and in the middle part you do this thing like a finger goes down and they eventually meet on the back so when they do you bring all the hair that's in between them like this and then you start tying the hair you need two hair ties for this tutorial and here we have it. How cute is it? And I'm gonna do the same with this side. Okay, so this is the hairstyle. This is like the cutest hairstyle I can do with my hair right now. I feel it's very, very cute because it's so short, so it creates like a bubble. And it looks like a hairstyle straight up from a Sailor Moon or something. It's very kawaii <laughs> and it moves. When I talk, it moves. It's very pretty and also I have straight hair right now, but if I do some waves and all and create more volume, it's going to look even puffier and I just believe it's super cute. And you can also do buns over here, so you can do something like this. So here you have the pigtails. Now for our fourth hairstyle, I'm going to do space buns. So for this, you need to split the hair in the middle. You need two hair ties for this. So you're going to grab half of your hair, like you're doing two pigtails here, like low pigtails. And you're going to start by just twisting around and passing the entire hair. But when you feel like it's your last twist, you're just going to pass like half of the hair like this and release it and I'm going to do the same on this side and there you have the tiny face buns and now comes the French braids and French braids can be a little scary if you're not used to them but believe me they are actually very easy to make and a really good hairstyle for any hair length. So I'm gonna start by dividing the hair in two and I'm going to put half of it on a pigtail just to take it off the way but this is not necessary it's just to take it off my way and now I'm going to start here on the top I'm going to grab three pieces and it always starts like this so grab three pieces like you're going to do uh, a regular braid and now I like to 
go below one another like you're doing a regular braid and once all the three chunks have already went below another chunk you're going to start by grabbing a piece of hair that doesn't belong to these three chunks and add it to one of the chunks so you're going to add it right here and hold and it did the same with all the chunks another piece of hair like this and go below exactly like you're doing a regular braid but now instead of just passing this lonely hair i'm going to grab a friend another chunk of hair and go below and here on the bottom when you finish just apply a hair tie but this is how it looks going to do the same with the other one All right, so here we have the French braids. All right, so the last, last hairstyle that I have for you, it's my favorite actually to do with short hair. And this one is very manly, very tomboy, boyish vibes, um, and very masculine, but I believe it looks so great on women. So it's what I like to call the sleek back wet look. And for this one, you need to first go wet your hair. Not too much, you don't need to completely go wash it, but just apply some water in it. So I'm going to be right back with some water in it. All right, got it a little wet. Now we are going to use some hair cream and hair gel. I have this hair cream uh, by Gizu. It's one of my favorites, so I'm going to apply just a bunch and then mix it with some hair gel. This is the Got To Be by Svarskopf. It's very strong, this one, so we are going to just apply a tiny bit and mix them together on our hands. It's going to look messy. And then we are going to just brush the hair with our hands to apply this mix. I only like to do this on the day that I'm going to wash my hair because it's going to look all creamy and a little bit disgusting but it's totally worth it. I'm going to brush it back like that slick and now I like to grab some chunks of hair and bring them to the front. like this that looks really cute I really like this it looks almost like an anime uh, hair as well those anime guys that looks like the hair is always wet and if you apply a lot of hair gel and hair cream it sticks for um, the rest of the day so I really love it it can play around and bring all the chunks that you want to the front and on this part you can slick it back even more if you apply more hair gel it really depends on how sleek you want it but yeah it's one of my favorites you can play around with it and be very creative and I call it the sleek back hair look Alright guys, so that was it. The wet hair look was the chosen one for me to wear the rest of the day, so you're probably going to see it on my Instagram because I'm going to shoot this outfit on the afternoon. I hope you guys like the hairstyles. Let me know down below which one was your favorite. Hair is going everywhere. <laughs> and also, if you missed the plot on my Instagram where I asked what you guys wanted to see, if you have any specific ideas you want me to do on this channel, just comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe, follow me on my other platforms, Instagram, TikTok, and Depop all of them are on the description and yeah that's it i see you around next week bye guys love you